Hey guys, Dan here from the iPod Touch World. Today I've got a review on Bubble Trouble, which personally for me uh, has got a lot of history behind it because I played this original game which was on the PC, I think it was just a Flash game or whatever. I played it a fair bit with my best friend in England and um, they finally released it on the iPhone. So I will show you what it looks like on the iPhone. You will see that you have got this character here, you've got controls down the bottom to move left and right and then the up key shoots a rope up and that's basically how you destroy the bubble. So as you see they'll break into smaller bits and then you get different power ups like this one will actually stick to the roof and then you get different power ups throughout the levels so this is the next level as you see a bit bigger and uh, it does get insanely frantic like you get heaps of uh, different balls heaps of different platforms just to I guess bring up the uh, difficulty and that's only a few levels into it. I can't even imagine what it's going to be like when you get to the final level. Um, I'll play the one I'm up to at the moment. As you see, it's already frantic as it is, and that's only five levels in. But it's definitely one of those games that you can just pick up and play, try and beat your uh, last score, and try to get through the campaign. So it's definitely an easy pick-up-and-play game. <laughs> It's a classic, like I said, I've played it um, previously on the computer with my best mate, and it's a lot of fun just to waste a bit of time with. So that's a quick review of Bubble Trouble, highly recommend it. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. Um, even though it is a great application, I can see after completing these few missions that you do have here, there's not much else to it. Uh, hopefully there's going to be updates in the future, but for now, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. So thank you so much for watching, guys. Have a great day.